This is my first time using open hand, so I'm just gonna see what it can do. I'm gonna try and recreate my site conundrum quest, which is a place to see who's working on hard problems and new ideas. You can uh, add people who are working on hard problems, if the repo's still up, the graph, and let's see if it can create the, just the create quest. I open hands, can you recreate this graph schema as drizzle or um, postgres schema and create necessary api routes to call it and page to call api route in a next js 14 app router i'll give it the code and see what it does to recreate the given graphql schema as drizzle or schema so all this workspace code is actually on my local and this whole thing is running in Docker. Warp, you can see uh, this is the command I had to run. Get it set up. Open hands demo is my project directory. The only other thing I had to do was add an API key. Are you able to insert this and create the file? Are you able to create the files and insert? Okay, there it is. Oh, it's there now. Now that the schema TS file set up, let's create the API row. Continue under app, API, quest, continue. We need a drizzle config. Drizzle.config.schema. DB credentials. Accept that. We'll make this local. Start a new project, Postgres, add it on line three in quest.ts, db.ts. I don't know why they can't just use the same .ts. And then I'm going to change this there. Install PG. So ideally, a lot of the stuff I'm doing it could do for me. So dot dot slash. There we go. Generate. Okay, so migration. Dot env. Yeah, so that was that. App. Um, create dash quest slash page dot tsx here and create a link to that no it needs to be in the format export default post okay. continue accept so this should potentially work in folder create dash quest. And then in there it needs a route. We need to create it. There we go. My review of open hands then is I really like the concept. It didn't put some code in the right places. I could have used it more extensively to try and solve the problems, but it seemed to be a little bit slow and um, not quite there yet, but I think it's pretty promising and, um, I want to even maybe try and contribute to it, even though I'm not the best coder in the world, I could help with some things. So yeah, that's my thoughts on open hand.